Hello everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel. So this channel is just something that I decided to start um, during this self-quarantining period. I know there's a lot going on right now and it's different and, you know, I'm learning how to use this and I'm trying to figure out what I can do to keep myself sane during this time. So... I decided I'm going to do a direct to draw channel. Um, if there's anything that anybody wants to learn how to draw, it'll be here and you guys can draw with me. So, before we get into the actual directed draws, I just wanted to show you how this works. So, this is my iPad screen. And I can move the paper around, I can zoom in, zoom out, and you'll be able to see all that. So if I was starting a directed draw and I have my paper like this, I would say, okay, your paper will be wide like a wall. Or if I wanted it to be vertical, I would say, okay, we're going to turn our paper and it's going to be tall like a building. So that's a, the terminology that I'll be using. And, um, you know, this is kind of different for me because I've never done something like this before. So it's going to be a new learning experience. Um, I love to doodle. I love to draw. So hopefully you guys can join me and learn some new stuff. Um, the other thing with this program is that you can't see where my pencil is. So what I'll be doing is before I start to draw on the paper, I'll be doing a mark with a circle or an X or an arrow. So for the circle, that's where I would use um, if I was going to draw a line or if I was going to draw a um, curved line. So anywhere that I'm going to be starting my line, that's where I will mark it. So for example, let me clear this. I'm going to draw a little box so it looks like a piece of paper. So if I were drawing a um, cat, for example, I would start out and say, all right, this is how we're going to do this. I'm going to draw a circle right in the center. So when I say we're going to draw a circle in the center, I'm just going to draw it. So let's draw a circle in the center. Then from here, so I will use a circle to mark where I'll be putting my pencil. We are going to draw a line up then down like an upside down V. Then we're gonna go to this side. And we're gonna draw a line up and down and draw another V for the ears. And then when I am going to draw the eyes, I'm gonna mark it with an X. So I'm going to put an I right here and then I would delete it and then draw the I. The other I is gonna go right here. Again, delete it and I'll draw an I. So all the circles, the X's or the arrows, those will not be drawn. Those are just there so that you can see where I'm putting my pencil. So then I'm going to be saying we're going to be drawing the nose, which is going to go right here, and I'll do an arrow, and that'll be the nose. And then I'm going to put my pencil here and draw the whiskers. Two lines out. Two lines out on the other side. So if I want you to do the same thing on the other side, I won't necessarily mark it. Maybe I will, maybe I won't. But if it's the exact same kind of lines, then I'll just draw it. So that is an example. Um, and that's how this will work. So there's also a link on my channel page to my Instagram account. So that's a private account and um, you'll have to click or request to follow me to see what's on there, but I'll be doing live streams every Friday at 11. So those will just be really quick and hopefully simple um, drawing sessions that will be less than an hour. So I think the max is an hour, but I don't think we'll be going for that long. Um, the first one is going to be this Friday, which is April 3rd. So if you'd like to follow me on there, you can. 
um, but the majority of the directed draws will be on this channel. So I hope you enjoyed this, and I hope you guys have fun drawing and doodling. Um, if you do follow me on Instagram through um, that account, you can send me a picture of the drawing, and I can post that on there so we can have like a little mini art collection of things uh, people have drawn, and we can just see what that is. So, all right, have a great day. Please stay safe. Please wash your hands. And I will see you again soon. Bye.